Green in our web and grandchildren. This is Jackie K bringing you more Golden Sun, the Lost Ages. Last time we explored this town of. What the heck is this town called? This town of. Madonna! Yay! We explored around and met Piers, who is currently in prison for being on a ship. If you're on a ship, you're instantly assumed to be a pirate. Because that's how logic works. If you're on a ship, you are a pirate. Now in this part, we'll explore area in here. There's not really much we can do in there now, but there's one thing I want to point out. But first, time to get the gin out of the way. I actually ran into a little bugger while grinding, so I definitely know there's one here. Of course, you're not the djinn I was looking for. Meet you when I do run into the djinn I'm looking for. Of course it appears in this patch of grass. Golden Sun Realm says it appears in the other patch of grass. Well, I think it is in, like, Pokemon, or where they appear in particular yet. I guess they could appear in the other one. Maybe I'm just getting lucky, though... I think it's a little more than just coincidence. How I could prepare a little more present than Jin is not a full fledged boss. I think I'll be fine. As long as the little bugger doesn't run away. Ha! Ah, I made sure you weren't gonna run away because I didn't mention it. Heck, you're probably still gonna run away anyways, Jin, but. At least I didn't, can say I didn't jinx myself. I was just waiting for myself to be proven wrong. Oh yeah! Jenna's apprentice, I almost forgot about him. Or, it's never really established what gender the gins are. I mean, technically they're beings of energy, so they probably don't have a gender. So let's call Kanda her. Just because Jenna's a girl, also. And also, apprentices are the same gender as their awesome master. Um, that's what you call someone in apprentice files, right? Uh, I don't know. Side way, and no matter what, we got a new Dijin. Iron was found, and Jenna got iron. I don't really want Jenna to have iron. Should be a you can have iron though. You'll increase your class, you'll become more powerful, and most importantly, you'll die less. Because we do not need another Sir dice a lot. I already went for that in one game. Anyways, if we go down here, yeah, I believe it's down here, we'll be in Radon Cat Combs. Can't do much now, but if we go this way, I know I said I explored this area before, and nothing important, it's just random goblin. Yeah, I mean, we're tech. There's not really anything we can do here right now. We can't get to that log because we're too far away. So, all we can really do is check out the other area. Oh, that bell reminded me. I did a little bit of in-between recording session grinding. And now everyone's at level 10. It's a sad day in the Golden Sun universe. You know why? I'll tell you why. Felix actually leveled up before should be uh... mm, it's a sad day to close the universe because of that. At least in my universe. I can't believe should be Champia. Why do I keep saying should be a for Champia? Maybe should be a sec secretly a Champia? <laughs> wow. So, according to me and my failure to talk, Shibuya is secretly a sexy champion. Wow. I never realized it, Shibuya. You have so many secrets. So, let's use your pirate powers to make a rope appear. No wonder you're so good with that. I mean, pirates deal with rope a lot, don't they? Um... Okay. I didn't mean to go in here, actually, but if we do go up, we'll see that we just end up there, so... 
that air that top area was pretty much pointless. Yeah, incredibly pointless, because the rope doesn't even stay. So just go from the top area, guys. Continuing onward. We climb down here. Read this. Look upon me with the eyes of truth. Then the door will open. So I have truth, huh? Sounds a little familiar, but I don't think we really have any synergy that can take care of it. Wait, who am I kidding? We have the power of pound. That'll take care of it, right? What do you mean I can't slam the door? Oh well. Guess we really can't do anything in here now, so... Well, I didn't realize that I was jumpable. I thought it was too far. Still kind of pointless. Anyways, how about I just meet you up at the entrance? So we're back in Mardra and not in town. Um, we've really taken a bit of a heat beating, so I'm gonna heal and then we'll go exploring. Yay! Just rest up at the end and get a nice long. Um, but not too long. Sleep. It was only 12 coins, so might as well make use of healing that's cheap while I can. Because you know as well as I that that price is gonna go up. Um, well, you know, I don't think we're going the wrong way. So, Mark? Yeah, we heard about you already. If we're going to Ocena, you better get moving. Alfara is up along the northeast of Ocenia. You'll see it eventually. If you try heading straight from Ocenia to Alfara, you'll hit the yep, desert. Pretty much better avoid the desert. Just following the coast to Alfara instead. Head southeast, and you will hit South Kias. Small village show. Probably not much to your interest there. Well, actually, there's something with pretty decent. Interest, at least to me. So, what do we get? Oh, I guess we can't really do anything here. I guess we'll have to wait until we go through the Sony Eclipse to make a choice. Let's climb down here. You would think they would put something in a shore like this. Something, anything. I guess not, though. This is a champion bolt. You can see. Mark and the flag there. They must have been run around here by the title. I guess even if they did free the free, they wouldn't have been able to go back to sea. Well, this sucks for the pirates. But awesome pirates probably don't. I mean, pirates are awesome, so if something bad happens to them and it sucks for them, that must be a sexy for us, right? I mean, she be a sexy pirate, she would know. <laughs> wow. I think I just found Shabia's nickname, Fee. Oh my gosh. This is a shocking discovery that will be remembered for the rest of the Let's Play. <laughs> um, what do you have to say? I mean, we just got a sword. I almost forgot about it. Wait, if this is championship, then that means Piers is a champion. Still, why does the Elder need Briggs to clear his name? Briggs must be trying to get a new ship. Help the Elder find some first. Wow. Oh. We still manage to have enough men to dig that hole in attack party. Enough to form two attack parties, too. I wonder. I mean, how bad can pirates be? I mean, Okay, they're, I know they're technically thieves, and they do hurt people in real life. But this is a video game in a form of media. So we must, since everyone loves pirates, we must display them in the best possible manner possible, right? I mean, Shabia wouldn't want anything better for her former. I guess this area was pointless. Alright, 
back, managed to get myself out of the woods. If you know what I mean. We were kind of in the woods. Now we're back on the right path. Well, I was gonna say we're out of the woods, but look. The bridge is busted. Who busted the bridge? I swear, if I fight out who busted the bridge, Ash was probably one of those giant meteors, like the ones that destroyed the first bridge that forced us to make a detour in the last game. I'm just gonna go with that bridge. And Dino up here. Man, oh man, the jokes I can make with this guy, especially since he interrupted me in mid sentence. That bike certainly hurt. I guess he's certainly Dino Might. Thankfully, he died. I guess my joke was so bad he committed suicide. Although, getting hit by a bunch of rocks from an axe probably isn't right. So, here's where we got a choice to make. We can either go north into the Yampu Desert, or head along south to Michelle. Well, plot progress along this way. And I'll show you. With as little spoils as possible, I'll just say we'll get a chance to get to Masali even quicker and get a couple things that we need out of the desert at the same time. So, in the next part of Let's Play Golden Sun, we're gonna head into the Yampei Desert. That is what the place is called, right? Yep. So, until next time... MY LEGS! MY LEGS ARE GONE! IS DEJA VU- Oh, there they are. IS DEJA VU ALL OVER AGAIN! THE TERROR, THE IRONY, AND THE HORROR! Ah!